love you for the rest of my life. Just love me for the rest of mine. Please, you have to believe me. I loved her. What does it feel like to get away with murder? She was asked God to save your soul. She asked the devil to punish you ever came. You know, you don't have to convince me. I believe you. Why are you protecting me? Because if I did anything to her, then I'm a monster. Did you notice anything unusual? In the north? What are they? You know how I think we should proceed? I should grind me up some Oxycontin and have a little snort. Well, um... Everyone in this town is going crazy. I think it's because of me and these horns. You killed that innocent girl, now the devil has claimed you. He didn't kill her father, and now people are telling me all these things I don't want to hear. I'm so bad. I'm bad. I'm pretty enough to be on TV, right? I gotta figure out who really killed Marin and get him to confess. Big. I would never hurt her. Tell me. Tell me everything that happened. Admit you killed her. It'd be such a huge scoop for me. I got an idea. How about you guys beat the heck out of each other, and the winner gets an exclusive interview with me? What's that snake doing around your neck? I made a new friend. Are those horns? Damn right, they're horns. So yeah, horns, what do you think? The whole premise of the film was Daniel Radcliffe seemed to have a very hot girlfriend. She seemed to die. Uh, Everyone's Juno seen... Temple? Or yeah. Heather Graham? I don't know, Juno Temple. I can't tell if Juno Temple's hot. I mean, she definitely is. So I can tell. Yeah. But she's got a weird face. No, oh, they all do. Women. <laughs> no, I don't know. She, yeah, she's, she's hot. She's in Hollywood. Yeah, but she's English. Probably attractive. Do you know, you don't know what I'm talking about, do you? I, well, I remember from the thing. I couldn't tell you what her face looks like. Her face looks weird. Do you want me to show yeah, me her face? Yeah, show me. I mean, she's probably listening, which is a bit embarrassing, because she's going to be listening to us saying that face is weird, and she probably really idolises us. That's her face look. Oh, okay, bit weird. She looks uh, like my cousin's wife, so... <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it is. If she's listening, I don't fancy I think you're boring. Um, I think that Juno Temple is going to really come into her face when she's about 50. How old is she now? Oh, about 20, 21, 22, 23, Oh, 24, they're all 25. Was she in Killer Joe? Have you ever seen Killer Joe? It's 25. Um, no, I've not. Really good. It's got Matthew Mahogany in. Matthew McConaughey, that's yeah. pronounced. And uh, he's really good. It's a really, really good film. Uh, it's got 70% on Rotten Tomatoes, so yeah. I believe you. Yeah, but horns. So Juno Temple may or may not die. He gets accused of it, gets off with it. Everyone thinks he did it. He grows, grows horns. Out of his head. Out of his head. Like a devil. Yeah. And then from the trailer, what I got from it is that... Um, he went a bit devilly. Yeah, he actually started manipulating people and telling people to do it. Like he, t he says... In his fake American accent, why don't you guys fight each other? And yeah. they do, and it's like, <laughs> that's so cool. And then he's got a snake. Yeah. I mean, again, it's this thing about trailers. It could be really great and fascinating and yeah. a real insight into the human mind. Yeah. Or it could just be a bit shit. And I'm sort of leaning towards it's probably going to be a bit shit. Well, I will say that I believe it's reviewed really well so far. Oh, right, OK. <laughs> the critics. And the book that it's based on, yeah, written by, I think his name is Joe Hill, I can't remember, the Stephen King's son. I'm just going to quickly look that Have you heard the rumours that Stephen King doesn't write all his own books? Yeah, go on. You've told me, but I can't remember. What's the, what's the rumour? Well, because they vary in quality so much, and he produces such a vast amount of books, mm. people have questioned whether he does actually write them all or not. Who, who would write them? Yeah, just ghostwriters. Who ghost just like, writers. He might have the idea. I'm not saying he doesn't have any involvement in it, but he'll just say, you know, this, this, and this. Yeah. Pay somebody to do it. And because he spell, knows. Spell cemetery wrong, go. Well, because he fine. knows his name now is sort of synonymous with that sort of horror book genre. Yeah. And he will sell. Whether it's shit or not, he's going to sell and make money. 
Yeah. I don't know if it's true. I don't. I've not researched into it. It's purely. Hang on. Um, here is why that theory doesn't work because he's written under a pseudonym before, Richard Backman. Yeah. So when? Seventies uh, and eighties. Yeah, it's not the seventies and eighties anymore. That's it's an true. old man. That's true. Oh, in, I'm not in saying he does do it. Probably, probably. I'm not saying he does do it, or I have any proof that he does it. It's just something I've heard. I want to see if this is on the Wikipedia page. Conspiracy. And could be true. Ghost. No. I want to Google this. I want to. I want to. I want to dive into this conspiracy theory. Dive it into it. Interesting. Stephen King doesn't write his own books. <laughs> word for word. Thank you, Google. Um. This is on TomBarryWrites.com. Brilliant surname, but... <laughs> Stephen King exposed books not all his own work, exclamation mark. There's a space before the exclamation mark, so I don't really trust Tom Barry. Uh, I'm not going to read this. Yeah, I mean, it's just something first, I've heard. First comment is by a guy called David Biddle. <laughs> it's just literally something I've heard. Um, I don't think that's true. But maybe it is. But even if it is... Maybe, I mean, maybe, he's still written a huge amount of books. Maybe Joe Hill, his son, wrote some of his books then, if that is true. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I know. But apparently Joe Hill's books are really good, and apparently Horns, the Joe Hill book, or Joe King, is really good.